Welcome. Today's tutorial is how to make sign. My name is Nancy Parks, and using some simple products, we're going to make a sign that we can display in our Halloween area. You can also make signs to um, mark up party areas, or just make one to display in your house. Let me go get some supplies and let's get started. For those of you who have been following our little series of someone cleaned up in our bathroom after a murder, um, these came out of the uh, slots that we cut for our towel rack and we thought they would make excellent signs, even a simple welcome. So we're going to glue them together and process them and we will so after they dry we'll bring them back and put some texture on them the welcome sign now let's glued I have single layer paper towel Cover the surface. for the effect When this side dries, come back and cover the back side. Well, we'll cover it in the same way. So we'll come back for painting and decorating. One will say welcome. I haven't decided what the other one will say yet. We are going to try a bit of stamping rag roll up technique here. We're finished.
So we took the insides of a shape that we like. But you can achieve that cutting your sign and rounding your corners. Covering it with the wrinkly paper towel. And uh, painting it any color you want and uh, stamping stamping it to get uh, to you like it and uh, writing the words <coughs> we are back I have written welcome on my sign with the magic marker Scripto. I'm going to try and trace that with some paint as best I can. The reason why I'm going this way is I paint naturally this way with my left hand. So I turn the board and paint that same natural direction.
There we go. So, we had a piece of cardboard, or two, glued together, some paper towels, and some paint. I now have a welcome sign to greet my guests. My friend suggests writing go home on the back side or stay out. <laughs> I don't know. I don't think that's nice, but it is funny. So, happy crafting. Thank you for watching my tutorial. Please like, subscribe, and ring the bell. I have a Patreon set up. If you are a supporter of the arts, then please feel free to visit me at nancyannparks.com. The one thing I want you to remember most of all is please remember that you are loved.